Penny is 10 years old. She likes to be around her friends. She likes music, lots of singing and dancing. <laughs> She's sassy. <laughs> she was born perfectly healthy. She was eight pounds and full of life. You couldn't take your eyes off her. She was very loving. Her first word was Harry, which is her brother, <laughs> which she said about a hundred times a day. <laughs> Harry, 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 Harry! It was one of the first symptoms we noticed was that she was struggling with hearing. Yeah. So you could, could literally come in the room and, and the door would slam and she wouldn't jump. <laughs> she had a hearing test and then it was suggested we got some hearing aids and that made no difference, did it? She was still, still right. not meeting meeting a milestones. Are you climbing? Good girl. Just after her fourth birthday, Penny was diagnosed with San Filippo syndrome, a type of childhood dementia. It literally feels like someone's pulled the rug from under you and it's devastating. We were told that her life expectancy would be anything between sort of 12 and, and 20 years. When you've got a little girl, you, you think about them going to university, getting a job, getting married, and in the space of one appointment, all well, that's taken away from you. Because the condition is similar to dementia, it affects her memory. So it's constantly having to show, remind her, going up and down steps, getting up out of a chair. We have to repeat that process over and over again so she remembers. But there is a place where Penny can go every week called Chuckle, and it's supported by your donations. It helps children with complex needs to engage and express themselves. It's more than just a group for Penny. It's like a little family. Music unlocks the world around our children, especially with one-on-one -on -one support. They become less isolated. The smallest thing means so much to us, isn't it? because she's lost so many of her, her skills. So to see her gaining new ones is just amazing. It's like that some magic takes place in there. I don't think it is just magic. I think they use... I like to think it's magic. <laughs> Penny loves the music. You really see her face light up. It's like somebody switched her on. She's happy, she tries to communicate with us. She's just joyful for the rest of the day. The thought of not having Penny in our lives, like, scares me. We know what's going to happen to her, but we don't let that overshadow everything else that is Penny.